Hello everyone, uh, my name is Wojciech Hozimek and uh, I am a CEO, which means that it will be a little bit more about business. Fortunately, my, math, my background is also in math and IT, computer science, so maybe it will be not all about business. Uh, and uh, the, the problem, the project I, I would like to tell you about is uh, about how to manage human performance, uh, large teams of humans, of uh, large teams of employees, uh, using machine learning uh, and uh, data science. Uh, this is a, a very long lasting project for us. We started it in 2017, or something like this. And so it's like four years now. And uh, the project was uh, had uh, several phases. So we are working with uh, uh, Polish uh, Academy uh, Institute of Science. Uh, we we are, we presented the project on different conferences. We even started. We even took part in X Prize competition. Uh, when we managed to get to the to the round three of this competition, so. Uh, it's a very, very long story, but to make it very short, what we are trying to do, okay, it's not slide by slide, but just make it more funny. Uh, uh, so uh, let's start from the problem. Uh, the typical performance management problem is uh, something like, uh, this is this, uh, the, it is the end of the year, and I, as a manager of the company, I would like to sell more something. I don't know, more um, uh, phones, more um, uh, pen drives, more computers, uh, or I would like to handle more calls in my contact center, and so on and so on. So I set up a goal, like I would like to increase something by uh, some percent. Uh, for example, uh, we had a, last year we had a pharmaceutical company which uh, had to increase the digital channel usage by 30% in uh, in uh, this year because of the COVID. Yeah, so we had a lot of medical representatives. They are running around the world, seven countries, uh, a lot of people, and uh, they need to switch their behavior from doing it personally to doing it via the digital channels. This for people like you, computer science specialists, people who know data science, looks pretty simple. But for but for the Medical representatives, the people that have rather medical degree, they are working on on on. Uh, they are working in, in uh, they are healthcare professionals. It looks a little bit different because we need to change their daily behavior. Like they need to arrange the meeting using the mobile phone. They need to set a note after the meeting. They need to contact to prescribe something to around something using the uh, using the computer and only at the very beginning only 16 per percent of them 16 percent of them uh, were doing this right using the digital channels at the end of the year over 70 percent of this uh, of these people are doing this using the digital channel but how this define the performance problem the performance problem is the problem usually of the boss or the manager who has a lot of people and needs to delegate some goal in a controllable way. So we have imagined this, we have like 10,000 people, each have different experience, different skills, different competences. Some of these people are new employees, some of these people are old employees, and so on and so on. And you would like to delegate the goal in a very controllable manner so that each day, each week, we know what's going on with the goal execution. It's not like, okay, we have a new employee, the new employee comes to us and he gets goal like, okay, you are new, so by the end of the week, you should sell 100 mobile phones or you should visit 50 doctors because this goal is not manageable. This person is new, we, not, we do not know anything about this person, and so on and so on. So starting, the idea is how to delegate this goal to different people, taking different characteristics of these people, and taking the 
dynamics of the market into, cons into, into consideration. Well, you know, now we have a hybrid work, we have COVID, we have all this, all this stuff. The complexity of our surrounding also affects how the goal is being delivered.